Hello, hello, hello everyone! NegroBMX here, and welcome back with more Pokémon Gold version randomized Nuzlocke. I forgot to have my light on, I just turned that on. So, it's been a little while since I've recorded, I haven't had the chance to recently, so let's... I know I was in Kanto. Ten badges, okay. Oh, that's right. The new wave bossa nova. <laughs> that's what it sounds like! <laughs> okay! Uh, oh, that's funny. All right, so we're we're in the um, what, what, what do you call it? The, I don't know where the hell I am. <laughs> the the where Zapdos was. Did I I must did I get the guy's Zap Cannon and all that? Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Looks like we're done here. Okay, so I guess now we'll go through Cerulean properly. We didn't really do that. Oh, I oh, I was just about to bring up the menu. Like, wait a minute, I have no idea who's in front or what I'm doing here. Okay. Well, look, there's a Blissey here. That's a lot of experience points, even at level 17. Uh, okay, so Blissey has really high special defense, but we could use, uh, like, Fly, for example. Should, should annihilate it. It has, like, the highest health stat of any Pokemon, and really high special defense, but pretty low defense. And due to the really high special, uh, defense and health stats, you usually get a lot of experience. Okay. Alright, Doggo's level 42. Yeah. It's, it's been a little bit. I, I've, I've, I'm very busy, and, uh, yeah. Well, I guess we'll just keep things the way they are right now. Go again. I'll skip them. Okay. Oh, I, I gotta mention the types. Of course, Blissey's normal type. Skip Loom here is um, grass and flying type, is what it is. I'm trying to remember if I got the thing that was essentially the berserk gene. But I think I did. I think I remember surfing out there. And I know that I could easily uh, just fly back to Cerulean, but uh, experience points. Although at this point, you don't really walk through any um, grass to get to Cerulean, so I guess that's... Uh... Oh, this is... No, this is correct. Okay. But I'm also giving myself time to get my bearings. I'll actually walk through this grass. So there's that. So, um, we did the power, we restored the power and everything, but let's do Route 24 properly. Because we have to get Misty back into her, uh, her gym. She's not in there right now. I'm sure I must have gotten an encounter there when I was surfing, so... Which means just going up to Route 25. I know I didn't get an encounter on Route 25. Not, not that it matters. I like the team I have, so I'm probably not going to go for, you know. Oh, there's a mint berry there. It's kind of whatever, right? There we go. So this is just like Gen 1, except it's just not on the bridge. All right, we got Gentleman Jill with a Ninetales. That's a fire type there. And hey, look, it's got a decent level. I'll go for Fly. Went for Safeguard? That's not a big deal. Not a big deal at all. All right, I'm just gonna finish him off with Cut. Alright, right there is level 43. So much for Gentleman Jill. Woohoo, good stuff! <laughs> There's round two. Alright, so here we've got Lady Mia. She's got two Pokemon. First of which is Arbok. Arbok's a poison type. 
So I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna hit it with the sacred fire here. Skip Bloom. We already dealt with one of these guys, so Sacred Fire. There we go. How could I lose? Well, you only have two Pokemon. I'm the champion of the Johto region. Here's number three, I won't be easy. Well, your mom was. Ah! Okay, we got Gentleman Noel here sending out Azumarill's. Azumarill's a water type. Um, I'm not particularly worried here. I'm just going to use Fly. Water Gun? That's... that's pretty weak. Not even Bubble Bean. Water Gun. I'm gonna hit, finish you up with Cut, I think. Alright, Rude Boy is level 43. Larvitar! So Larvitar is the uh, rock and ground type. I really can't hit it with anything, so let's go over to, um, Doggo makes the most sense. Well, Salad would've worked too, but... Whatever, right? Just gonna hit him with Surf. Okay, here we go. We've got Lady Max. War Turtle. Another water type, but not particularly worrisome. Gonna go for Fly. Using Withdraw. Okay. So that's a defense plus one, and Fly is is a physical move. I believe all all flying type moves are physical, but that was a crit, so that Withdraw didn't matter because critical hits ignore stat changes. Uh, I mean, uh side of the opponent, at least. Okay, so Spiro, that's a normal and flying type. Um, I'm gonna go for fly again. I only have one sacred fire left, so I'd want to keep it for something that's gonna be a... Oh, mirror move! Okay. So, I'm gonna want to be the one to get hit here because I'm faster. That's just the way mirror move works. So let me go over and use cut. Enough of that, right? <laughs> and the last one's Smeargle. Smeargle is a normal type, and it it just tends to copy your moves. So we're just gonna use Cut. If he survives, he'll use Sketch, and he'll learn Cut, but he won't be able to use it. You know, it's, it's a whole thing. But as you can see, he did not survive. I don't see Smeargle all that often. And then immediately into this one. All right, Dancer Mia here uh, with Sandshrew. Hold on, let me just... Okay, so Sandshrew's a ground type. Um, you know, I've been doing pretty well here with Cut. <laughs> Let's just do that. Oh, wow. Oh, Poison Sting, really? As long as I don't get poisoned, I'm cool with it. Alright, there we go. Whoa, too much. Mm -hmm. 
All right, Lady Joe, uh, coming out here with a Weeping Bell. All right, so Weeping Bell is is grass and poison. So this is a pretty good opportunity to use my last Sacred Fire, but I'm not going to because it's also weak to flying type being grass type. So you know, I'm keeping it in case I run into like, like an ice type or something. You know, got it. All right, Omanite. Okay, so Omanite is its a pretty hard counter here because it's water and rock type. So I'm going to swap here into Salad. I mean, it's only level 29. Alright, Vaporeon. The water type, so we'll just stay in. Vaporeon's got a lot of health, but with a level differential here, this should be a one shot. There we go. So much for Lady Joe. You're kidding. Moo foo foo? People don't actually laugh like that. Moo foo 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 foo. You, you see that in, in... Well, I don't want to say that you see that in Japanese games, at least for Pi. I was gonna, Caesar! Okay, so Caesar, yeah, this is a perfect example. Caesar's only weak to fire because it's steel and bug. Um, so we're gonna use Sacred Fire. You, you, I don't want to say you see it specifically in Japanese games, but you see it in English translations of Japanese games. Aren't you tired at all? That's one. Oh wait, no. you gotta talk to him. Got my nougat. Unfortunately, it's not randomized. And then you fight him. Mostly because he just wants to fight you instead of it being like in the previous generation where the last guy was like Team Rocket. You know? Bugcatcher Zoe coming at me with Wobbuffet. Wobbuffet's really annoying. Wobbuffet has really high health and some pretty pretty strong defenses, both physical and special. Um, and it doesn't tend to have any kind of like physical attack or, or special attack. It really just counters you. Um, this could be dangerous. I'm going to use Cut because it's a pretty safe move. It's probably not going to kill. Yeah, not even close. I want to see what he's... Okay, so he's going for a safeguard. Um, yeah, this is a problematic. It's a, it's a psychic type, and I think... The problem is the more damage I do to it, the more damage it could potentially do to me. So I think I'm going to throw a Rude Bat out here and see if we could uh, enact some trickery here. So he went for counter. Counter would, What counter does is if you're hit by a physical move, it doubles back the damage back. But I didn't hit him on that turn. I swapped. Okay, so what I think we'll do here is we're going to smoke screen him a couple times so that if he does get counter for physical moves or... Um, I, I forget what the... Uh, Miracle. There it is. The, the physical... The, the non-physical version is Miracle. He has to guess right whether I'm going to use a physical move or a, or a special move, but, um... Hold on a second. Okay. So we're hoping that, like, if he does, inf safeguards mean safeguards preventing me from using like toxic or something. But I'm not trying to do that. Uh, one more, I think. Okay. That if it does come through, that he guesses correctly, that he's gonna miss. All right. So let's hit him with sludge. It's a pretty strong move. I'm not gonna poison him because he's got safeguard up. So he went for the mirror coat and missed, which is pretty great here. Okay. I'm gonna go again. This one might kill. I hit him pretty hard there. 
that's enough. Yeah, Wobbuffet is a, is a scary Pokemon to run into in a Nuzlocke, especially once he gets his ability that prevents you from swapping. Alright, Articuno. Alright, so we got a legendary um, Ice and Flying. Um, we go to Debbie, because Rock type. Agility. It's a plus two to speed. And I missed. That sucks. Safeguard's gone. Okay, that doesn't matter. Powder Snow is technically super effective, but not a super strong move. It hit me pretty hard, though. Oh, I got frozen. Shoot. I'd have to swap. Um. I use Doggo. That sucks. Oh, because I missed on the rock throw. Uh, I just use Surf. Articuno honestly doesn't have the greatest stats or typing, so... It's a cool bird, though. Right, it's gonna take three, it looks like, unfortunately. Yeah, critical. I was hoping for a crit. I was the one who got crit. Alright, that'll end it. Just smack him. Alright, Pinchy's level 41. And the last one's Nido Queen. Okay, so Nita Queen is a uh, poison and ground type. Being part ground type, we'll just hit him with surf and that'll be that. Alright. Alright, so let's grab whatever this is. Calcium. That's funny, because I'm pretty sure it actually was... It wasn't calcium, but it was one of the other... Um, vitamins in the original game. Like, you know, a protein or a, something along those lines. There's Misty on a date. And he runs off just because I showed up? Let's pop in here real quick. Talk to Billiam. No. Bill's grandfather, at least. What is it? What am I... Oh. Here, look at my salad. Yeah, whatever, dude. <laughs> I don't know what he's looking for. It's probably randomized. Actually, I think, you know, normally it's like Lickitung and Oddish and, and uh, Pichu and stuff like that. But I don't, know if, I don't know if what he's looking for is randomized. I don't have any of the ones that would normally be there. All right, so we're gonna head to the um, the Poke Center, heal up, and then we're gonna do Misty's gym. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Normally, obviously, it's a water type gym, but we'll see. It's a lot of water types. We might run into one or two, right? 
Okay, starting with Designer Robin. Got two Pokemon here. The first of which is Slowbro, which is actually a water type. Slowbro is water and psychic. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and... Here, I'm gonna use Fly. Let's see, one for Water Gun, not a strong move. And I missed. Great. Alright, let's actually swap. We'll go to Salad. This Water Gun is just really not gonna do anything here. And then I have options. So Bite is super effective, uh, Razor Leaf is super effective. Razor Leaf set Stab, so we'll go with that. Hold on. Farfetched? We'll swap. It's normal flying. Uh, we'll go into, I guess, Debbie. I think he's Rock Throw. Farfetch can be pretty strong in terms of the physical attacks. So. Um, Alright, so Rock Throw. Alright, Director Daniel coming out with a Quillfish. Quillfish is a water and poison. So, I think, you know, I'm just gonna go for Fly, I think, instead of trying to swap. I don't really have a good swap into water and poison. Because, yeah, I don't have a good swap into water and poison. Because poison would hurt Salad. But they probably didn't have any really good poison moves. Probably because there really weren't that many great poison moves that Quillfish could get back then. They didn't get Sludge, you know? Uh, Horsey, okay, that's water type, but it's not exactly very strong. Unevolve. We'll use Fly. I'm actually running into quite a few water types in the water gym. Uh, why do I keep missing Fly? Fly is a pretty accurate move. <laughs> Yikes. Alright, do it again. Imagine if you missed the first part, and you tried to fly up, and somehow missed. That would be a hell of a thing. All right, Marowak, ground type, not particularly threatening here. I am gonna go ahead and use Fly again. And for Rage, okay. So I don't think that counts towards the Rage counter since he didn't actually get Rage off. Because normally when you're using Rage, you sort of lock yourself, well, you don't really lock yourself into it, but you can sort of like continually use it and every time you get hit, your Rage grows. And then just Misty's left. So far, all of them have had water types. Uh, water types are very common type, you know. All right, Designer Forest, only one Pokemon. And look at that, it's a water type! It's Quagsire, look at that. Quagsire is only weak to grass. Uh, I think I definitely want to swap into Salad, because Quagsire can be quite annoying. Amnesia. So his special defense went up by two, uh, which is annoying, especially since Razor Leaf is special. All well, grass type moves are special prior to Gen 4. This should still hit pretty hard. Wow, we got him. 
I was a crit, that's why. Okay. Sorry, just Discord. All right, Misty. Let's do it. Watch her not have any water types. That would be really funny. That would be hilarious. So she normally comes at you with Golda, Quagsire, Lapras, and Starmie. Um, let's see. Kabutops is a water type. Look at that. It's water and rock type. All right. Swap right over to a salad because it's water rock. Leer? I'm not worried about Leer. Okay. Right, let's go ahead and Razor Leaf him. Even at these high levels, that's probably a wrap. That's probably a wrap. Yeah. Alright, Salad's level 43. All right. Oh wow, Meganium versus Meganium. We're gonna swap. Okay. Obviously, Meganium is a Grass type. Yeah. Obviously, I'm gonna go into my ho -Oh, and we're gonna use Sacred Fire. Look how sly Meganium looks in the front sprite. Got him. All right. It's level 44. Fire Blast. Um, I'm going to pass on Fire Blast. It's, it's just as good power-wise as Sacred Fire, if not a little stronger. It doesn't have any more PP. It's a bit less accurate. And it has a worse burn rate. I think the burn rate on Fire Blast is... I want to say 30%, whereas it's 50% uh, for... For Sacred Fire, although I certainly, it certainly hasn't felt like a, a 50%. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna take Fire Blast, even though it's a really good move. We already have a really good move. Magneton, we will stay in for that. So Magneton is Electric and Steel. Obviously Electric type, a little bit hinky there, but we're really high special defense, and we're probably faster, and we have Sacred Fire. Yes, yeah, so I would be trading in like a stronger like power of the mood of the move for a lower burn rate and less accuracy. And no advantage or disadvantage on PP, so. PP. Right. Okay, last one's Grand Bull. That is a um, normal type. There's no reason for me to really swap here. Of course, now it's fairy type, but then it was a, uh, it was normal type. I'm gonna go for sacred fire. Pretty great, and we got the burn. Okay, so he's going for rage, which is heavily nerfed by the burn. A little extra damage there, and I'm just gonna go for sacred fire because there's no way he survives it. Did I get a badge from her? Or... I feel I, I wasn't really looking at it, and I feel like she didn't give me a badge. But then again, the badges don't show for for that. So, all 
I mean, I beat her, so, you know. I'm sure it said that she gave me the Cascade badge and I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, head over to Poke Center, heal up, and then we're going to stop this video and move on to the next one. It's a good day to record because my bag is out and I'm in pain, so I'm just trying to sit still and recover, you know. Alright, so I'm gonna stop right here. I'll see you guys real soon with more Pokemon Gold version, randomized Nuzlocke.